Oh, there we go, Bit Kid. Entertain us. We are playing Chasm, a game that actually surprises me that not more people are talking about because it's a procedurally generated um, Metrovania. Metroid. Yeah, Metrovania. That's the correct <sighs> phrase for it. And it's cool. I mean, really cool. So we're going to add a profile here. And we'll name ourselves in 54321. So, what should we name ourselves? Let's go with Lurch. I'm gonna go with Lurch. Sir Lurch. There we go. Actually, let's add an exclamation there. Because it's Lurch! Yes. There's our seed. Normal difficulty. Let's start this game. Let's start the adventure. Let's. It is creating the world. Oh. Excuse me while I drink a little Jack Daniels honey. Oh, that is good. Hashtag not sponsored. Ah, there we go. As you can see, beautiful 8-bit graphics. Sheriff, I thought I'd find you up here. Did you fall asleep while watching the knights ride off on their mission? Don't worry. You're the brightest recruit this outpost has seen in some time. Soon you'll be a full-fledged Gildian Knight, and I'll still be here running errands for the commander. Which reminds me, he sent me to find you. Your orders are to report to Commander Six Lords. Silzer's office at once. We're gonna go with Six Lords. Sounds like something out of uh, Dr. Seuss. You had better hurry. He even seemed more impatient than usual. There we go. Rani, Rani. Okay, yeah. This is our save spot. So. That's our tablet. It tells us that we can save. Okay. Well, not really, actually. It gives us a little bit of the lore of the game. But who cares about that? Honestly. Not a lot of action morning, but the view shot is beautiful. Okay, nothing worth seeing there, <laughs> except a beautiful view uh, over here. Sorry, I can't train in the yard with you today. Yenvik says I need to stay in bed until I get better. Stop back and tell me if anything interesting happens, okay? Okay. Uh, by the light of the Watchers, I hereby pledge my soul to the land of Gildia. I will illuminate the place where darkness dwells. My shields shall always be ready to defend those who are defenseless. I shall seek to be brave, just, and loyal for the glory of Giltia. Okay. Sounds like some kind of oath that you'd have to take when uh, enlisting in a uh, guild for World of Warcraft. I heard the commander's looking for you. You better not be making trouble like the rest of the recruits. Oh, that might actually be a woman. Now that I mentioned it, the cheekbones are kind of a giveaway. Okay, there we go. General Cyrus T. Folly. 
was gonna say, it really sounds like a cooking utensil. That's the last time I threw toast in your favorite. Oh, sour grapes, sour grapes. If you ask me, the commander's horse eats better than we do. Okay. You know the rules, recruit? No one leaves this outpost without the commander's approval. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Come on! I want to get to adventuring. What are you? In the year 398, the tyranny of Lyhan's despotic get uh, blah blah plot. Blah blah waste of time. Hey, have you come to borrow another book, little boy? Remember, even the mightiest warrior can go strong knowledge. Uh, okay, this is just telling us that the two recruits that were caught gambling, they got extra duties, okay. There well, you are. Go right in, the commander's waiting. Okay, thank you. Hello, commander. At ease, recruit. I have a mission for you. There's a small mining town about three days' journey to the west called... Carthas. This morning, I received an urgent letter from the town's mayor. He reports that the miners were attacked by a wild beast while working deep in the mines. Now, they refuse to go back to work until it's been taken care of. I know this sounds like a trivial matter, but we depend on Carthas for supplies and raw materials. As you know, I sent the knights on a mission yesterday, which leaves me a bit short-handed. I need you to go to Carthas and do whatever it takes to get those mines up and running again. I want you to dig deep into that Carthas. I think you're ready to become a Gilardian knight, but you must prove yourself first by going deep into that Carthas mystery. Do you understand? Yeah. Good. Head to the armory and get properly quit before you set off for Carthas. Godspeed, recruit. Remember, dig deep into that mystery of Carthas. Okay. Wow, your first mission. I had a feeling today was going to be your lucky day. Be careful on the road to cart ass. The snowstorms are treacherous this time of year. Okay, there we go. Woohoo! We're going to cart ass. It's the road to cart ass, yes it is. Ho oh ho! Come on! I'm just skipping with joy. So the commander is sending me on your first mission? You'll be needing a weapon then. Take a sword off the rack. Make sure to equip the sword before you set off. Just remember, your training will be fun. So one of the things I really, really do like about this game, not only is it Metroidvania, but there are aspects. I am currently level one, and there are aspects of, you know, role-playing in here. There we go. We got the sword. So some of my earliest... I think we're pretty much done reading for a while here. So, some of my very first gaming experiences were role-playing. Uh, specifically, The Bard's Tale. Uh, I used to play it with one of my brothers. Uh, and if you know The Bard's Tale on the old Commodore 64, you will go, but 
that's only a one-player game. Yes, he drove the keyboard. He did the spells. My job was mapping. You heard me. Mapping. So, not only would I end up having to... With graph paper, map out each and every move so we didn't get lost in the dungeons. But also, uh, make sure that I denoted where monsters were and what battles we had partaken in. How's that a video game gaming experience? I don't know, but it's one of the few pleasant, pleasant memories I have. Uh, that particular individual. Uh, I mean, don't get me wrong. He also helped coach one of my basketball teams and everything. And uh, he and his co-coach. Oh, look, Carthas established six seventy-two. Excellent. We've got a horse. And it's cold. Uh, but no. Okay, let's go ahead. We can save Neil. Record your progress. Uh, Neil at the shrine. Uh, what, is, what are you? So, yeah, he and his uh, co coach got. Uh, uh, there's a treasure chest there. I want. Okay, it looks like I can't get to it. King's being driven man by magical forces. Uh, not horses. Forces. So, yeah, he and the guy, his best friend who was uh, helping them uh, coach <laughs> got kicked out of the game once for calling. We were playing a team that uh, called every single play and did so like blue 42 56 238 go uh just random arse numbers and the orders would come from of course the other team's coaches and everything and so they just shouted out they started shouting out random numbers carth ass minds employees only all others are prohibited. No entrance in rear. It's locked. Okay. So, here we are. Going, let's talk to the sleeping mayor. And we will do that next time on the Gaming with Dad show. Bye-bye. So, here's a video and a subscribe link. Make sure to subscribe, ring the bell, like, comment, all that goodness. Thank you.